hath honoured me of late, and I have bought. A veteran of stage and screen, Patrick Stewart can now add a knighthood to his credits as he celebrates becoming Sir Patrick. New Year's Eve and the honours list is out. Also to be knighted, British and Irish Lions coach Ian McGeekin. I still can't believe uh, you know, the honour. It's just uh, it's amazing, I have to say. Obviously a knighthood is very special and, and uh, uh, if I'm honest I would never anticipate it, uh, you know, having, having had that that honour and uh, it is a huge privilege. Also in sport, Britain's most successful gymnast Beth Tweddle now has an MBE. The news broken to the gold medal winner by her mum. Well, my mum actually opened the letter because it arrived at my parents' house and it said on Majesty's service. So I think she was getting a bit excited. So she rang me saying, can I open your post? And normally she just forwards everything on. So she suddenly started screaming down the uh, phone when I said, yes, she can. And I was like, let me in. What's going on? What's going on? Because I hadn't sort of put the two and two together. So she got really excited. <laughs> Another world champion of 2009, Jensen Button, celebrating today, crowning his Formula One glory with an MBE. In music, after rocking all over the world for more than 40 years, the two remaining original members of Status Quo are also recognised in today's list. Rick Parfit and Francis Rossi are awarded OBEs for their hugely successful musical career, including more than 118 million record sales worldwide. Britain's fashion industry too has been recognised, including a gong for the founder of Ultimo Lingerie, Michelle Moan. Um, so it just shows you if you work the hardest you can work, um, the world is your oyster. And of course, those who mustn't be forgotten are the many unsung local heroes, people like 70-year-old lollipop lady Heather Morris from Cheshire. She's been given an MBE for services to education. And I looked at the letter, and I looked at it, and I looked again, and I thought... Goodness. So I showed it hubby and we both looked at one another and he said, you've got an award from the Queen. It's lovely. It is really great surprise and I'm dead chuffed. Just one of the 979 people who will be celebrating hard this New Year's Eve after making it onto the honours list.